time now. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Well, thanks for that, Peter. I'm uh, more than ready to get going here. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Well, Harry Kane merits a mention. What doesn't he do well? Leads the line, drops deeper into space, he runs well with the ball at his feet, and he's rarely wild when attempting an effort at goal. He's been a great, great find. Well, quite no argument for me on that one. Aim forward. Vardy tries lifting it over. He's tried one! Ball's loose, who's getting there? Promising cross. It's well blocked, and back out it comes. He'll have a go! For Tongan. Deli Alley. Well, Brighton goes long and forward. For Tongan. Deli Alley. It is deadlocked. It's a loose ball. Now the pass. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. And the players are flocking round their fallen colleague, and they look worried. Got a chance from here, but not the kindest angle. Can he put it away? And that's caused a worry or two. Well, if he hopes to do better than that, he's got to work on his technique and his timing. The contact wasn't right there, so there wasn't much chance of success. Aurier. Half an hour played now. Wanyama. Dembele. Eriksen. Rose. Deli Ali showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Away from immediate danger. Rose, Musa Sissoko, that's an untidy challenge, free kick given. And it's Kane, can he find a finish now? And it's a goal! Half time rapidly approaching. That could be a big one. What about that, Jim Beglin? I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement. And when all of that is synchronized with the right pass, that's what happens. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. And we've reached half-time. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. Um, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. And we're off again. 
So, 45 minutes to turn it round. Musa Sissoko. Kane. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. James. Mares. Morgan. Hoot. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Alderweireld. Deli Ali. 60 minutes played. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, they may be down, but they're far from out. In terms of chances, they're right up there with these opponents. Morgan. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and if he's allowed time on the ball, it opens up a wealth of other possibilities. Goes wide. Vardy looking to get on the end of this. Urie. Christian Eriksen tries to stroke it through. Kane plays it out to the flank. Or Brighton battles to win it back. Spoon forward. Ericsson. That's good defence. Uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. It's a long forward pass. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. Alderweireld. Ericsson. Maybe had a foul. Yes, the uh, referee's given it. real confidence about them and they look as though fitness levels and energy are still strong but they have to maintain possession they can't afford to lose it again Fuchs tries to get it forward quickly and it's Fardy looks like a good ball through Gray, Gray plays it in well, that's not the cross he had in mind there is the final whistle Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. Well, once they went behind, I just wonder whether the manager can be pleased with himself. I thought he could have done a little bit more to get them back on level terms. And all that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening to one and all.